Hello guys, welcome in this new principle tutorial in which we're going to talk about the export options. So we're here back in this um, uh, project and um, let's go and uh, explore the export options. So once you have your preview uh, area opened, you have to go on the top right uh, section and um, you'll see this uh, icon which um, it has uh, three options so record with uh, either the touch cursor the arrow cursor or the cursor hidden and um, so basically the touch cursor it's uh, a kind of um, cursor which um, um, simulates uh, like a, a touch motion um, the arrow cursor it's pretty much the same as you have in your uh, computer and the cursor hidden will not show any cursors in uh, your recording. So for this example, we're going to use the touch cursor. And uh, as you can see now, it's recording since uh, the icon is uh, uh, becoming red and uh, black. And uh, in order to stop the recording, we simply have to go on the top right again and click on the icon. And at this point, we're going to have two options. Uh, we can either export a, dot, a .mov file or a GIF. So the .mov won't have any other export option, while the GIF has uh, four different options. Um, two of them, uh, it's the Dribble uh, default ones, so it can be the Dribble Retina, and uh, this is 800 of width uh, by 600 of height. Then there's the smaller 400 by 300. And then there's these two options, which uh, it's uh, either the height, which you can uh, modify. You can make this number as big or as small as you like. And um, this one is a percentage uh, compared to your original artboard. So once you select uh, one of these options, you can just click Save, and uh, you're going to have your... Uh, project uh, animation saved. So this is it for this lesson and we'll see you in the next.